Let us pray. Lord, we thank you for your lead, for acknowledging that we have many weaknesses as humans, for inviting us to know you as our guide and inspiration through Jesus Christ, for showing us another way, a spiritual aspect to our human lives. We give you thanks for that invitation to enter into your hopes that you have for us, to receive your grace for ourselves and others, to feel your love you have for ourselves and for others, for the invitation to live by your example of healing and peace, for inviting us all to use and share our strengths rather than our weaknesses in the hope that we can all make a difference to our communities and our world. We thank you for your gift of your Holy Spirit, both comforter and encourager to serve others. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for those who have financial worries, worries about jobs, businesses, homes, energy bills, food bills, child care costs, addictions, medical bills, any other worries, Lord, we bring to you that people have regarding money. We pray that they will all find the people, help and support that they need. Lord, we pray that we can all be that help to somebody, maybe even to many. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for those whose loved ones are ill. We pray for those who are suffering with their own illnesses or pain. We pray for those anxiously awaiting test results. Lord, we pray for those who tirelessly care or work in any way for those who suffer illness, for unpaid carers at home, for all healthcare professionals here and worldwide from scientists to pharmacists and all others. Lord, we pray that all those who have continued to keep us well and safe, those key workers, will not be forgotten whenever they need our help, emotionally, financially or spiritually. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for those who are grieving, Lord, may they feel comfort and peace. Lord, many may not believe the same in faith. Many may not know of your presence in their grief and loss. Many may not believe that their loved ones are with you forever in wellness and eternal life and love. Yet so many of us worldwide, Lord, still remain strong in faith and belief that this is all true in our hearts and minds and in our lives. Lord, may we, as those people of faith and believers in you, be bringers of your peace and light to somebody during their loss. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord, we pray for our wider world. We are all trying to stay safe and well and strong as best we can during these difficult times. We pray that we can, at the same time, still help those who are worse off than ourselves, who are suffering from losing everything, through loss of loved ones, through climate, wars, oppressive rule. We give thanks for those working tirelessly for cures, for funding to continue, for vaccinations, and for treatments worldwide and for charities. We pray that we become a nation of charity which is abundant in our community but that also stretches further to those in need in our world. We sit now in a few moments of the quiet time as we bring before God now those known to us and those situations who need our prayer at this time.
Merciful Father, accept these prayers for the sake of your Son, our Saviour, Lord Jesus Christ. Amen.